In the last couple of months, I made a small mobile game. In spite of all, you play a doll that got bitten by a radioactive spider and suddenly developed spider-like superpowers. You swing through New York City, run away from Octopuppets and fight the Green Goblin. Oh, nice game you have there. It would be a shame if I would delete it. <laughs> I got this mail from Apple. It says your metadata appears to contain third party content. Specifically, it would be appropriate to revise or remove any references that mislead users to associate your app with Spider Man, Iron Man, etc. Does this look like Spider Man to you? Or this? Or this? Or this? Or this one? How about this one? Or this one? Or this? Or this. Or this. Ah, uh, maybe they actually have a point. I had 14 days to remove all copyright infringements or Apple will cancel me and remove my game from the App Store. Yeah, sadly, the complete game is a copyright infringement. I had to change a ton of skins. But luckily, there was a skin challenge running on my Discord server, so I could use the skins created by my community. I mean, a lot of them weren't usable either, even though they look so damned cool. Just take this baby Yoda, for example. <laughs> But all the good original skins made it into the new Apple version. I also changed some of the old skins so they don't look like the originals anymore. But what will I do with my main character? He's somewhat important since uh, he's also on the app icon and stuff. I can't just replace it with a weird random skin, right? So I drew a completely new one, a spider. This way the name of the game still makes sense. The end result turned out quite nicely, so it's at least a small consolation for the removal of all the other great skins. Nonetheless, I had to hurry to finish this new version since time was flying and I really- Ow. Too slow, noob! Yeah, I failed to finish the update in time and Apple deleted me. I still had Doc Ock and the Green Goblin in my game, so I tinted the Goblin purple and turned Doc Ock into... Eh, yeah, a real octopus? I published the update and now all Apple users can play the different version of spider Doll. At least it's back in the App Store. By the way, everyone using an Android phone can still use all the great skins as well as 10 new ones from the skin challenge. Android is much better than Apple anyway. Now that the game has been published for a couple of months, I also wanted to give you a quick update on how much money I earned. On Android, 140,000 people downloaded the game and purchased stuff for 3.3k euros. 85,000 Apple users played this game and spent around $2,000. This is approximately 1.7k euros. I earned $700 with the advertisement in the game. This is about 600 euros. So all in all, I made 6,600 euros with the game. But sadly, I won't get all of this since a big chunk is subtracted for fees and taxes. I get around 5,000 euros. Yeah, I'm still not rich. Let's see how I can pay my bills in the next month. Yeah, come on, I'm not that desperate. Enchanté. Yeah, please donate me a subscription so I don't have to strip for you. And like this video if you liked it. See you next time.